like that in this area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Top two and not two. You getting stopped at the goal line. If I drop you, I'll be on Fox News with Vada and Showtime. Going by Doncic. Could be fun. Doncic. Oh! Hold on. That's in his bag as well. Oh, you ain't watching the... Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc. etc. Don't let none of that get too far. Hit here, you know who I be. Follow me on IG, Vada underscore fly. Tell you my mind said hi. Shout out to my brother Showtime SP and everybody who watches this content, whether religiously or in passing. And shout out to our partners over at Fox 5. We will be back on the news this week. You know what I'm saying? We got none other than viral Gotti, Geechee Gotti in the building. Uh, we will record. We will uh, talk about some things, talk about his battle, talk about the run that he's been on, and just everything that's in correspondence to him. You know, we use that platform to give light and shine light on battle rappers. You know what I'm saying? That's just what we do. Um, A Ward. A Ward. Shout out to A Ward and everything that he's got going on. I'll break that down in one second, but I definitely had to um, highlight another battle that I just seen pop up on the time pop up on the timeline, which is none other than Calico versus Pass. Bullpen and Dope in the Pen presents Dope in the Pen October 28th. Calico versus Pass. The next top bull tournament in all is going to be going down at the Continental Club. 1658 12th Street, Oakland, California. You can get the tickets at dopepeneventbrite.com and you can get the pay-per-view at rapgrid.com slash dope in the pen. Oh, it looks like it's going to be a ruin your day joint. I did see uh, John John versus Mr. Fab, and I heard Loso leak his joint on the pay-per-view stream the other day. It's looking like Danny. He said it, I said, don't get mad. None of you battle rapper niggas say something to me. I'm too, I'm serious too. I'm talking to him, and you niggas be sensitive, and I'm saying the truth. Leave me alone. I like most of y'all. Um, you know, sounds kind of fire. Now, Calico is who he is. Pass is like a legend. You know what I'm saying? We all know he's a legend. But in Oakland, it takes it to another notch, you know what I'm saying? This might probably be one of Cal's toughest battles because I, I, going there, I'll break it down with SP. We'll talk about it, you know what I'm saying, and our thoughts and our winners as the card continues to unfold. Uh, shout out to the bullpen, John John, all of that involved. Y'all niggas know, yo, y'all yo, need some commentary. I know some dudes who did Max Out and who did Chrome. We just hit a million in, in like six days. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like a million in like six days because, you know, viral Gotti, viral round. But we did Max Out too. If you guys need that, y'all know how to find me. Don't call me like two days before, three days before, 48 hours. Niggas got like four weeks now. You can call me. We can work it out and make sure that we, we get it done if y'all, if, if necessary. Listen to this nigga. Don't listen to this nigga. Don't listen to this nigga. This nigga ain't got no sense. Need. If you don't need it's cool, you know it is what it is. But I'm putting it out there. I hate the leagues be trying to call me like two days in advance. Like, yo, will you fly to uh text? No, I will not. You know what I'm saying? Hit me early, I'm around. That's that announcement about that. But shout out to Dope in the Pen, shout out to Mr. Fab, John John and Don, ruin your day and all the things that that come with that. You know what I bring. That's all I'm gonna say. You know what I bring, you know what we bring. I asked. Um A Ward. Shout out to A Ward and everything that he's got going on. There's been a conversation that's been going around. I've seen it. Um, Verve has said something about it. Other people said something. You know what I'm saying? So I think that I should give my personal perspective on what I think. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, it does mean something to somebody. Somebody somewhere means something about what I got to say. You see what I'm saying? All right, cool. Um, it's, it's a notion that A Ward has lost his last five battles in a row that weren't males, you know what I'm saying? Because they threw Vixen in there, obviously she was one of his last five battles. So I took the time to like look through all of his opponents that he had and I could come up with a comparative model to see if he actually lost all five of these battles, you know what I'm saying? Um, so it, it, what, what happens is there's things that I have to take into consideration, you know what I'm saying? Obviously it's the battles, it's the league, it's the situations, everything that goes into it, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I have come up with the model. My personal thing is I feel like I feel like A Ward should take 
just a little break. I'm not saying you should stop battling. I'm not saying you shouldn't battle every week. Every what? I'm just saying that I feel like the repetitive pace of him battling every single week, every other week, every other week, it wears on you. You got real sick, Charlie Clips, Verb, Frack, and Big K. That's a run right there. Those are a lot of different battles, and he had Vixen too. Um, now, I'm not telling nobody here to get their money. I just want y'all to know this. I am not telling him how to get his money, but what I'm saying is when you add cut to the product, it stretches it out, and it's not the same as somebody who battling somebody who ain't battled in four months. He got Big K. Big K was ready for him. I had Big K winning. I was there for that. Frack, I, was there. I wasn't there for that. I saw it in its entirety, but I felt like Frack was going to win that anyway because Frack only battles like once or twice a year. So he's bad. he don't battle much, and you battling somebody's battles every week. And then plus, you know, A-Ward don't have a good record versus white people, you know what I'm saying? I'm just calling like I call it so I can't spoil it, you know what I'm saying? I can name like three or four other people he lost to. Mad Flex, obviously I said, Big K, uh, Ill Mac, and Real Deal, all these motherfuckers. If they white, they right when it comes to A-Ward. It is what it is, period. I don't even know if he battled Real Deal, but still, I, I think he did. But anyway, um, and it's just like not on my mind right now. And if he did, you know what I'm saying, I, um, I'm going to get that right, you know what I'm saying? But, uh... If he, battle, if he battle Real Deal, he probably ain't winning, you know what I'm saying? I'm just be honest with you, because Real Deal beats everybody else. Anyway, yeah, he did battle Real Deal. Yeah, my bad, my bad. That was on uh, that was on the Gully vs. Gannick six years ago. Uh, I definitely think I had Real Deal winning there. Real Deal don't lose many battles, so uh, this is White Guy 2-1. I was reading some of the comments, White Guy 2-1, White Guy 2-1, White Guy 2-1. <laughs> anyway, but nah, Ward, they still got some Ward wins in here too, you know what I'm saying? I'm just be honest with y'all. I'm just calling like I call it so I can't spoil it. A Ward's energy is awesome. He did real good versus um, Dill. Ward is a professional as they come. Uh, I never heard of A Ward. It's the first line I became a fan. So he might have got real deal. I got to watch that shit again. I ain't perfect. Um, so now you're looking at the situation where, like I said, he's battled Big K, Frack, Verb, Clips and real sick. Um, losses that are like, I really have as losses. Big K loss, Frack loss, real sick. Those are three clear ones, three clear. The Verb battle, a lot of people have Verb winning, but there are a good multitude of people that have A Ward winning. I'm just, I, I'm calling like I call it so I can't spoil it. I was definitely one of the uh, people that was doing the pay-per-view stream where Verb did get one of the performances of the night. My personal pick was Ill Will. Uh, Frozenberg's pick was B-Magic, SP's pick was Verb. That's how we went. Bang, bang, bang. So I had Hitman. I mean, I liked Hitman versus Ill Will. I just felt like Ill Will did a little bit more in his third, so I edged the uh, battle to Ill Will 2-1. But out of these five battles, how many did he legitimately lose, lose, lose? K lost, Frack lost, Sick lost, Clips debatable. I was standing right there. I felt like it was 1-1 going into the third. That battle could have even went either way. So it's not really clear. These aren't clear, clear, concise losses here. It's a lot of battles. It's a crazy, hectic schedule. But I don't really think that... It's 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 six it's five or six clear losses and when you have good battles and you're not getting smoke it make it bodes well for you. I'm not the person that's oh the white person can't do this the black person I ain't that guy I'm not that guy I'm like live and let live you know what I'm saying I don't really get involved with all of the racism and shit like that because at the end of the day I'll be honest with you white people did a lot more for me in my life than my own people did and it is what it is I have no problem saying that in my personal life from Age one to now, in my adult years, in my working years, white people did a lot of shit for me. So I never would sit on camera and talk crazy about any race. That's just not what I do, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to every race out there. I'm just making a play for what A-Ward has going on. Um, I think that it's October. Ideally, I wouldn't see want to see A-Ward with more than three battles for the rest of the year. You know what I'm saying? I know that's probably not going to happen. Got our, so he's the only person that battled on Blackout both days. I told y'all when Loso was battling, I said he was going to battle again. He spit a bar the next day. I said, what the fuck? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Now, so I'm um, back to the topic. I'm cool with out of these five battles. I'm cool with going two and three. Two and three. The clips could be debated as a win. The verb is a debate. Niggas debate that. That ain't no clear, clear, clear. Like he got bodied or he got smoked. I was standing right there. I don't see things how other people see things, but that's good. I'm glad that I got my perspective and my viewpoint. But if you're asking me, has he lost his last five battles? No. And then when you go before that, you got Vixen. So that's six. It makes it three and three. I don't do verse males versus females. I do battles. So I got him at three and three. It's not four and two. It's not five and one. It's not six and oh, but it's not getting smoked. And in every one of these battles, the frag battle, no, nah, that was kind of, yeah. <laughs> so, so that frag was not that it. 
The Big K battle, he did good, but he, Big K was just different. The Verb battle was one of his best performances. The Sick was probably the best performance, but it's just he battled so much. I'm not giving no excuses, you know what I'm saying? You, if you battle real sick who ain't battled in four months and you get smoked, nigga, hey, that's what you think. What, what Six said, leg, they back, they arm, they repeat what he said. I, I agree with him, you know what I'm saying? I've been in there getting my shit together. We got some different different things coming up. I ain't really gonna say, you know what I'm saying? You might, <laughs> you might, I can't tell you where you might see me. Is I'm just gonna say. It might be a little bit more than TV, who knows? But um, back to Ward. Uh, so yeah. I think that Ward's stock is still in a very good position. You know what I'm saying? He just came off the Charlie Clips battle. Uh, I like the ball, the, the Fox Five with Fighter Fly and Showtime. He said, if I drop him, he said, I'm dropping. I could drop him in no time. I drop you. I'll be on Fox News or Fox. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, come on, come on. I like that shit. Uh, I, I like how Avo Pan again. Let me give you some flowers to Avocado real quick, yo. This man, Avocado, is like a genius, dog. Like with that Ruin Your Day rap real shit. He like a wizard, bro. I don't even know how he caught me with the camera that was back there reacting to a bar that was happening way up there, but his mind is designed to be inclined to find things that I might not find, you know what I'm saying? So he got that boom wham that could hit the boom wham and get you on the boom, you know what I'm saying? I'm, 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 I'm way in the back, you know what I'm saying? I'm way at the top, like Sting, you know what I'm saying? But when it comes to the pay-per-views and shit that he do, I like to be, he wants me near him, so when it cuts, we ready to go. So I stay up there all night, he flipping the camera back and forth. I thought that was amazing work. Uh, like I said, shout out to Bullpen. Uh, shout out to A, uh, A Ward. I don't have him 0-5 or 1-4. I don't. I'm sorry. Maybe I look at battles a little bit differently. And when something's debatable, I call it as that. When, a, when the other person has a strong amount of battles that the other person is saying that they won or fans are saying they won, you got to give love. And that's what I do. Spread love to all of the dead dogs. Um, other than that, you already know what it is, man. Shout out to RiceGameClothing.com. I got every single order out yesterday. Every order. I don't owe, no, I don't owe a single order. Every, all the people that got their tracking numbers and things like that. Um, you know, I definitely appreciate all of the folks that do copy, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of people that's been copying, I've been working overtime to try to get these orders out and shit like that. Cause I know how it is. If I order something, where my shit? I'm checking the mail every day. Where my shit? Where my shit? Where my shit? Come on, about to fly with my shit. So I get it. Uh, but everybody got their stuff. Uh, we got it out within a week and you know, that's pretty good. And we're gonna continue to move, you know what I'm saying? I still got product. If the best way to show that you support what we got going on, I don't jump on it, I don't be asking for cash app, I don't be asking niggas to send money every day and shit. I don't do that, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, the people that support us support us. If you support us, you go, you cop a sweater, you cop a piece of merchandise, that helps. That's the best way, you know what I'm saying? People ask me all the time, how can I give, how can I give? That's the way, you know what I'm saying? So, somebody watching this, go to RiceGangClothing.com, pick what you want, and let's get it on. Gang, gang, don't bang, salute to every one of y'all.